When you are ready to use your outriggers, you'll notice the outriggers will be locked into place. You'll come over here to this locking pin right here, pull the locking pin. You will then rotate the outrigger out. This pin right here locks the outrigger in narrow or wide mode settings. Currently, this is the narrow mode for the outrigger. This is narrow mode right here. And then wide mode for the outrigger is gonna be all the way out here. Keep in mind with narrow mode, the machine will not rotate over that side of the outrigger of the machine. So if the outrigger is in narrow mode, the machine will not rotate over that outrigger. Right down here are the controls for your outriggers. When you are ready to operate your outriggers, make sure all the outriggers are locked into place and then you'll operate these. Each one of these is labeled. So we got one, two, three, four. When lowering the outriggers, one at a time, lower the outrigger to the ground. That's just to clear any obstacles. Once as all the outriggers are touching the ground, use two at a time to lift the machine up evenly. You wanna make sure that you are level with the bubble level right here. And if you need your tracks to go from wide to narrow mode, make sure your tracks are completely off the ground and you will use this control level right here to make your tracks go from wide to narrow mode. 